next 10 years, I'm dedicating myself to accomplishing 10 goals that absolutely terrify me. Design and build a forever home from the ground up. I'm a companion. I'll go anywhere you are. I ride my bike with you on the handlebars. Up the hill we go, 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 go. Down the road we go, 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 go. All around we go, 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 go. I'm a long shot in. Twenty acres. Yeah, we're about to go see the 20 acre house. <laughs> well, 20 acres, how many is the house? 8,000? Uh, 18,000. 18,000? But that's with your basketball court, which is probably at least 10,000. <laughs> the brother probably listening like, what the fuck are they about to go look at? <laughs> it's a compound. Only in Texas. <laughs> I just remember it's when I first YouTube. met you, we were in Austin for that photo. Yeah, Naturally I was just home. talking about yes. that on my video. Yes. Yes. How I came with a pair of shorts, one pair of shorts yes. and one pair of shoes. Yes. Then you guys show up with like suitcases. Yes. <laughs> and like all these things. I'll be like, what is going on? And I'm like, I am not prepared. <laughs> wow. Yeah, so then it even has that little wow. area on that side too. So the, the 20 acre, that's not, I mean, so the, there's another gate outside of this gate. Yeah. God. So we were just saying this is perfect for Nala because it's like just enough for Nala to kind of run around. The property sits on two lots. Uh, there's a fence you can see way in the back. That is the property line. Okay. Um, and on that side, there's lot number five, which is seven acres as part of this property. Okay. And then this lot is 13 acres. It's a good day. I'm sticking to you. I'm happy to be on the way alongside of you. Well, these guys are really into technology, so the whole house is, this was redone, the whole system, the control for uh, in 2019. I'm just be standing here like this, naked. I'm just like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching your videos. Yeah. <laughs> Why don't you edit the, uh, this out? <laughs> There's a bed in here. Yeah, so oh, what's the thought um, they entertain a lot. And sometimes yeah. their parties are linked. So if one of them is tired, <laughs> they come over here. They're kind of well, away. Okay. That's oh. very thoughtful. Now, the people yesterday who came said they would turn this all into additional closets. Yeah. Yeah. Shelves and, yeah. you know. Oh, that there are windows. That's so weird. <laughs> Party so hard, I That's need for to the sleep in the closet. Yeah, yeah. baby. Then. <laughs> Substantial, and there's sub zero. Oh wow, the brand. Oh, okay. I was like, 
<laughs> Mortal Kombat. He used to play that last night. <laughs> so we have like I don't even know what to call it <laughs> like a extra like kind of gaming toy like work study and then you got the room the restroom little connecting uh, game ish area right yeah and then another room here so it's kind of like the kids area up here with, yes, yeah yeah great places to lounge it's hard to imagine without the kids you know, yeah <laughs> view in this room is for the Oh wow! It's like an upstairs master. Wow. Do you ever like this? Is ever kind of make? I'm just putting my head in the mind space of getting and having a kid. Right. I'm just gonna give them all this. This is great. This is luxury. <laughs> they don't have to earn this. Well, <laughs> that crazy. Yeah, no. <laughs> as overwhelming as this lot could seem, you have to put yourself in the "I can dream, I can see it, I can envision it." mentality because honestly the deal that we would like the price of this place is insanely cheap for what you're getting but you're gonna make up for that cost in the fact that okay there's a lot of things that need adjusting and altering for me to actually be like really happy with this place and feel like it's ours at custom you know what I mean so mm. now, these cups are great the Stanleys they're great keep everything cold got a straw love it Imagine black paint everywhere, but you leave the wood color, and then you have a nice you match, and then a nice match wood on the on the ground with the black logos and black quartz and black framing. Done. You could sell you could. one of the lots. Yeah, if you didn't do anything on lot five. In lot five, this is, is just all like lot totally, four. So we're not even on lot five. No, so we no could sell all the building five. is on lot four, and so lot five is just vacant land you see this lot have this is the whole property here yeah. 20 acres so this chunk is lot five so and this is a different one so wow. that's a whole piece of land like thing and that is one two but you're getting the whole thing for 4.2 million oh, okay. here so with the lots. house so i could say okay i'm gonna buy the whole thing and then i'm going to build whatever i want on this side to be my home i'm gonna sell this whole lot with the house separate as a whole deal, yeah, and I can and then I sell over two point five million. Okay, two point five. Then you get then then that can be gone off your hands. You keep that acre, which is like seven eight acres, and then you sell the other ten, all in one. So you can break it up into two. Damn. Then you can build free or like wherever you want. Every from scratch. It's like what you want. Exactly. On it. <laughs> Decker, you can be a model. Little model. You can be a buff bunny model. <laughs> <laughs> Everything outside of this like five acre stuff, it's not in a gated neighborhood, and you'll be out in like the farmlands. That's where we just were. We just yeah, that, and we just looked at the basketball. Yeah, yeah. Thing. How'd you? I want you to come over so we can go over it. Go, go through it. it. it I saw the me, pictures it's, online. It's, it's it's like a lot. It's, it'll be a lot of work. It's a lot of maintenance, and it's a lot of work. Though. Do you like the land though? Price. It's twenty acres. Yeah. yeah. Get this. Like Is it ten or twenty acres? It's a lot of land. But it's two lots in the twenty acres. Uh, here, Christian, all the, all this width and all the way back. 
And the nice thing is the land behind is restricted to farm, so you're never so you never have people. That's there. why that guy loved it, the one we designed for. You're in the mentality now to kind of be a little low key Bro. vibe, like monk, literally monk. Vibe. I bought the third iPhone Mini 13. You're like regressing to I'm, the real world. I have to, bro. It's good for you, dude. But you could go this, and then you're saying, boom, yeah, you complete two legs, you. two legs, Damn. and then you just have a fire in There's the middle. There's privacy in the middle, and every bedroom will have a view of the courtyard or the grounds. Lining, I'd yeah. almost go like you if you're gonna do your activity it. stuff there, I'd almost go like one and two. Like if yep. you have the garage that side, yeah. one, two little area there. Agreed. And then line the whole thing. I agree. Just to like make the most out of the space. Yeah. Because I want you to have a lot of green space too, like grass and stuff. Oh yeah, forget yeah, about like, that. So you can have, yeah, <laughs> that you always put concrete on everything. Yeah. We want like greenery, Beach. pool, and then layout area. Yeah. I want like an outdoor cabana vibe. Like you can like chill outside. Like the Kardashian, yeah. like yeah. You know yeah. how they have it at the end of the pool, like yeah. that thing. In the center or at yeah. the yeah, okay. in the center and you walk to it and sit and watch and like a TV. lower level fire pit in the corner yep. or something. And the pool, the infinity pool should leak over into the wall of the fire pit. Yes. So the water falls into the fire pit side, yeah. Okay. Yep. This is what I like because it's a clean cut. Uh, I think we should be nice because we're gonna go one story and wide. We're gonna 9, hit. Nine thousand. I used to say ten is a safe spot. Yeah. Just because I want to for future, Christian right. might come up with an idea like I need a room for maybe yeah. what from home podcasting or whatever. Let's have it. Yeah. So I would say in the 10 ish, give or take, yeah. but under 10 is, I feel like it's a waste. We're wasting land. I would use it up yeah. as long as we protect your outdoor wish list. I would s screw it all up with house. It's like five, six bedrooms that you could like use yes. for other things. I like it. I mean, I think, I think we should build from scratch, build exactly what we want. Yeah. Yeah, I was like in love with the other place. I was like, Heidi was in love. She I was sold. in love, but it was the acres. It was the 20 acres of just land of like yeah. deer. Remind me of like growing up, being yeah. on like tons of acres and just but playing. The house, but the actual house I was like, this is a lot. She made the comment. She goes, because we're coming over here. She goes, where are the kids gonna play? I'm like, I know. Well, we'll so I play. Heard two acres. I was like, <laughs> where are they gonna play? There's there's no acres. I want them to build like tree forts and stuff, but they can do it out. Me and on the other area. Throws in the front yard. Yeah. <laughs> play with the neighbors. I've never, I never played really with my neighbors. She's a hard to label, untamable woman. Just where do you see her? Uh huh. She's a monumental, well, a symbol, stunner. changing subject completely okay back to fitness i bought a bunch of therabody stuff off of uh, therabody <laughs> th off of amazon actually oh, okay but uh this one here is the leg thing obviously this is a size medium which fits my legs and your legs apparently uh no my feet are like not at the bottom where are your feet here no. it's like my toes at the but it's super nice. It's like this little thing pumps out like air and then it's kind of like a blood pressure thing. It squeezes you and you know, lets you go. <laughs> <I know. laughs> but there's that. I got like this little gun, which I actually like love using. It's um, nice it just fits in the bag. Like that. I'm trying to take care of the body, you know? Take care of this, this gem is Ferrari that I can't buy now because Brian a house. <laughs> or anything, because they're buying a house. <laughs> that means we're gonna be on a budget, huh? Yeah. We're gonna be on a budget. I'm permanently on a budget. Me too. Oh. oh, wait. Is that all it does? It just releases and I'm done? Uh, I've had like 70% of my macros so far. My current macros are 300 carb, 40 fat, 225 protein, 17 days out. Current weight is like between 178 and 181. I'm fluctuating, so safe to say solid 180. It's like 7:20 p.m. and we're about to head to the gym. Or get ready for the gym. I should say get ready for the gym because uh, Alphaland closes at nine today, so it's going to be cool because we, we're going to get some like really cool content with the gym being closed, which I'm pumped for. It's been like, a, I don't think I've done that all prep, actually. So it's like, nah, it's like 8, 8.30 almost. Is it 8.30? 8.38. Oh, okay. Time to go to the gym, Sunday night. 
private workout. Those are my favorite. I kind of do this towards the end of prep. I love those. Just like no one at Alpha Land. It feels like the old days. The legend is Guzman collab from last year or two years ago. We're doing one and a half scoops of that. One scoop of the peach flavored pump. It says no caffeine in it. So if you're ever working out at night, or like just later on in the day, and uh, prefer not to have caffeine, but you want a little something for the gym, like after work, like 6, 7, 8 p.m., you're going to the gym, pump is a great substitute as a pre, without the caffeine, so it won't keep you up like all night. I'm just a freak and I can take caffeine late and still go to bed, so. I'm gonna go one scoop of hydration as well because I'm gonna be sweating so much, so I wanna stay hydrated and keep those electrolytes and stuff. So code CG, okay, is gonna save you 20% off anything from Ghost. Uh, again, my favorite stack right now is the, really, I've been doing the All Out Legend pre-workout, which is like the strongest pre-workout um, that they've come out with. Second product is Pump, I would recommend to you guys. Third product is gonna be, for me, this prep, hydration. So one, two, three combo. You can get whatever you want, again, for 20% off. Just use code CG at checkout. Are you ready? Okay. Camera. Oh! <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so if you Ooh. saw the last video, then you'll know that Nala oh. has not been <laughs> feeling too well. She hurt her paw when uh, we were out of town for my show, and now she's feeling better, so we're taking her to Alphaland. Okay, so a little change of plans. So it's currently Sunday, which means it is, I forgot, but it means it is actually the uh, weekly or bi-weekly gym staff meeting. So all the employees stay late. They take the time out of their schedule on Sunday night to come into the VIP room uh, and we go over all the updates um, and that they need to know. So I'm about to join, kind of sit in the back and then do something at the end to incentivize some growth here. So check it out. Since summer shredding, amazing, amazing job. Uh, this crew has been doing, doing, the progress has been insane in the last year. I just want to say thank you all so much. Who came up with the Rice Krispie idea? Did you? That's you. That's you? Okay, yeah. so we have a $250 bonus I want to give right here, because I think that idea is awesome. I'm actually going to also allocate three more $250 bonuses to the next pay period. Why your paw don't hurt, boy? Oh, now you feel fine, huh? I didn't run around until long. This is the Rice Krispie thing I was talking about, actually. Be strong. Like, all these cool quotes are written on these Rice Krispies, so. That deserves a bonus. That idea deserves a bonus, in my opinion. So that's all we did, all right? And that meeting, uh, just wanted to encourage the staff that, or let them know that one, their work is noticed, two, it's appreciated, three, just really honestly a big thing right now is that staff members don't want to like snitch on coworkers, quote unquote snitch on coworkers, when those coworkers are not doing their job. They're not fulfilling their responsibilities and Guys, God, I don't want to, I need to work out, but I will go on that rant if you want me to go on that rant and, and give you all my thoughts on that. If you do want that, comment down below. We'll do it on a separate video and I can go into like any business stuff, like, just let me know, team stuff, building stuff, like uh, just how you handle staff, people, like that's stuff that I've really been putting a lot of my time into recently uh, and realizing how important it is to like grasp, right? People are the hardest part of any business. Uh, the growth, of, and especially like leveling up a business and taking it to another level. People, 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 people is the hardest part. Yeah. Like always. <laughs> Let's do this. Maybe it was soft, but. Come here, let's get a group photo. Group fam. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Oh, is she protecting me? 